What is up guys, Pinky49 here. We are back on the desolation map and I got some progress to show you today. We're back in the ghetto. I didn't do it that time. In the ghetto, we're back in the ghetto because I've been working on, you know what? It's the Axis Chemical, my friends, and the Axis Chemicals is, it's gone up a lot faster than I had anticipated. I don't know, I just got a, a passionate kick. I just felt the felt the urge to complete it. It's not completed. It's not completed. Got more stuff to do, but I've worked on it so much. Let me get on the juice to make sure you guys can see what's happening here at Axis Chemicals. So once I finish this, all I gotta do is fill a few more buildings in the ghetto. Uh, just tie up some loose ends, and that's that's that. <laughs> okay. We got the, the sludge thing. Look at that. We got sludge moving through the building. I don't know, my friends. I don't know. It's, it seems like this is going to be one of the coolest places to PvP on the map. Possibly. You know, but the, the, there's a weird thing about PvP. It's like, you know, sometimes the areas that you think are going to be great for PvP aren't. And sometimes the areas that you didn't think would be so good are. It's weird, okay? I don't know. We'll see. Only time will tell. As you can see, I've worked on this a lot. Uh, the last time we worked on this was on Monday's episode where we discussed building tips. Oh no. Oh, I'm trapped. <laughs> or am I? Oh. <laughs> so yes, this is a vat of sludge in there. This is where all the sludge is going. See, the sludge is coming out and it's pouring in here. Oh boy. D disgusting, right? So look at the, what we got here. It's very vertical. It's very 3D. Like I said, lots to work on still. It feels a little bit empty in here. And I'm going to rectify that situation. I'm just going to walk around. I'm going to rectify that situation. What I'm planning on doing today is actually working on this a little bit more. I'm probably going to do a little cut at this juncture after I show you what I've got so far. And then uh, I'm going to work on it a little bit more. And then I'll come back and maybe... I don't know. I'm not promising finished product, but it's possible. Not finished, but uh, just this floor area. This uh, factory floor area. Uh, I'm not going to call it finished. Do you guys have any suggestions for what I can put in here? Well, save your suggestions to the end of the video, because I am going to put some more stuff in here. And at the end of it, uh, maybe you guys can give some suggestions. That would be fantastic. So what I'm going to do now, oh, I also have to work on this. This is going to be the office of the, the big wig. And I also have to work, so it's not as close to done as we once thought. <laughs> I also have to work on this. And I started it, I put up the walls, but we got a little parking lot down here. I don't know, I might have a little branch off in this direction. We'll see. Um, but uh, for the right now, this is big enough. I'll put some pillars up so that this place feels like it's supported underground, right? You go underground, you need some pillars for support. So what we're gonna do is I'm going to cut the video. And when we come back, I will have a lot more progress, or maybe a little bit more progress that looks like a lot more. I don't know. We'll see what we got when we come back. All right, guys, be back in two seconds. And we are back. And I gotta say, it's time to pat myself on the back. Oh, man. All right. So, Axis Chemicals looks a little bit more fleshed out. Let me show you the exterior first. Oh, yeah, I added some graffiti. Can you read that? Can you read what that says? Maybe it doesn't say anything. I don't know. Added some graffiti over here. Just the small little touches, you know? Nothing fancy. And then, can you read that one? All right, so I added some graffiti. That's the first thing. Let's see here. Um, I worked on some... What else did I work on? <laughs> I worked on other things. I put some debris around. Oh, the piping is probably the biggest difference. I added a bunch of pipes, my friends, and these pipes all go from somewhere to somewhere. They don't really make sense. I don't mean, there's no real process here. I just made a bunch of vats, okay? Uh, but they go everywhere, and you can parkour on some of them, others not so much. Um, some are just aesthetic. Others, like this one, are totally meant to be walked on, most deaf. Right, look at all this. All sorts of ways. Okay, so we bring ourselves inside. You know what, I'm gonna get on the juice because you're not gonna be able to see anything. All right, here we go. I like it, the juice, there we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Should we start from the bottom and go up or go up? I don't know. 
let's just start from here because this is like the uh, entrance the unofficial entrance here so i did apocalypse a wee bit just a wee bit uh i didn't want to go too over the top in here just because you know this is a, a chemical factory and there wouldn't be too much to loot and scavenge in here in the post apocalypse so i don't imagine too many people would have come in here looking for goodies but uh, i did have a few dead bodies okay maybe this could be employees maybe they could be looters or rioters but uh, I'm, I'm feeling more like they're employees just because I don't know, like I said I, I don't think there's much going on in here I mean let's say you're starving you're hungry <laughs> wait aren't those the same thing you're thirsty uh, you need uh, weapons and ammo and armor you're not gonna come to a chemical warehouse or a chemical plants or a chemical factory right you're gonna go to houses and supermarkets so uh, yes that's what I'm trying to say is that not gonna find too much stuff here. I guess this is the official entrance for the employees. Oh, one thing I wanted to note while I'm out here is there's no way into this place unless you figure it out, All right? There's no like easy way in. Yes, you could use TNT and blow your way in. That's fine. If you wanna do that, that's up to you. But there's no like obvious way in. So this place is gonna be kind of difficult to figure out, right? Oh, I don't know what to put back here. I'm, I, was, I was thinking homeless shanty town. Uh, all sorts of possibilities. If you guys have any ideas, you know, I did food trucks over here. Not there. There's, here's <laughs> food trucks over here. So that was uh, one thing that could be done, but I've already done this, so I don't think I want to do any more food trucks. So no food trucks. Let's say let's say no food trucks. I have done a homeless shanty town several times, so I um, mean we could do that, but I just really want to hammer the point home that there's a lot of homeless people in this city before the post-apocalypse they weren't taking care of each other right they were spitting on each other and you know abusing each other and all those different things that people do to to promote hatred okay anyway um so there's multiple ways to get up here i can't wait to pvp on this thing guys i'm like oh man i'm just gonna build for a few more hours and just fill in the, the small details and and get things done in here and then i'm gonna be ready to pvp it's gonna be so much fun i added some debris i added some like computer workstations a bunch of levers here i don't know does it make does it look cool or, or no is it just me to me it looks really cool i really like the way this thing turned out and uh we have all these pipes here moving throughout the the warehouse or the factory and most of them come in here Notice these things. Oh, so there will be some benefits to coming in here. But, um, yeah, these pipes. Oh, I didn't show you that. Sorry. Sorry. Let's go check that out now. These pipes head over. <laughs> so confusing, this place. Over here. Here we go. So we got pipings everywhere. Everywhere. Piping here, piping there. So all the pipes, like, like I said, they actually seem like they might be functional. Possibly, right? Uh, they're just going to different places. Oh, yes. Yeah, so there's a, there are a few things I have to do. Like in here, I have to put. A, I was thinking a bunch of workspace space, and then same with this. So I have to get this done. This is something I'll do off camera, obviously. But what do you guys think so far? Is it coming together? Do you like Axis Chemicals? I'm biased since I built the thing, but I'm feeling like this is going to be one of the best places to hang out right do you think that's a, a valid statement like this is gonna be a great place to spend your quality desolation time there's just so much to see so much to explore uh, i will put various you know things to loot and scavenge okay it's not gonna be totally devoid let's just say that you're not gonna find any food okay or you're not gonna find too much food let's put it that way mm, maybe some weapons Maybe you're gonna find a lot of chemicals. Huh? A lot of chemicals in here? What do you think? What do you say? A lot of chemicals. And what that means is. Oh, I haven't shown you up here yet. What that means is potion stuff. Oh, so if you're if you're ready to step up your potion brewing game, then uh, I added some slime. I think it's a bit too much. I don't think slime would be there or there. I don't think it would be that far out either. I'm just trying to show that like slime missed its mark, right? Oops. Oh, that was like a ninja block place. No, not floating slime. There we go. Oh, I did it again. Look how easy it is. <laughs> anyway, um, yeah, it's just to show that the slime coming down is just, you know, missed the hole a little bit. So there's some residue, of course. Oh, we're running out of juice. 
And uh, that's pretty much the gist of it. Like I said, there's a lot of levels of parkour that you can get to. A lot of things have to be parkour to get there at all. And uh, the last thing I'll show you is the last part of the last things I have to do. And we're ready to PvP. I want to make a PvP game out of this so badly. Like, can you imagine, like, PvP in here? Maybe we'll just play GoldenEye. So this is one of the last things I have to do. This is going to be the Big Wigs office. You know, you know, the guy who kind of runs the show. You know, the, while the rest of the employees are kind of... Where should his desk go? I think his desk should be here. While the rest of the employees are, you know, busting their butts, working for minimum wage, this guy's just sitting in his office. I'm going to put a mini bar, nice couches. He sort of has a view of stuff. Doesn't really have a view of the factory floor, but that's okay. He doesn't like to... He's not trying to get his hands dirty with factory employees, you know what I'm saying? They're a little bit beneath him, if you know what I'm saying. Uh, so he's he's making phone calls, you know, he, he delegates responsibility. He doesn't worry about what's happening on the floor of the factory, okay? He's that type of person. Not that that's a bad thing. I, th I think we do need somebody to lead the masses at some times. <laughs> you know, not all the time. Okay, let's see. Put snow here. So I'm not going to finish this today. I don't want to make this video too long today. It's just because it's, you know, Wednesday. It's a hump day. You got homework, right? <laughs> I don't know. Um, I, I'm, I'm having a lot of fun doing a lot of things off camera. Um, not only is it making the videos better in my opinion, but it's also making things go a little bit faster around here on the Desolation map. Because uh, it's, it's encouraging me to build more. Because I want to show you guys as much progress as I possibly can. So I'm just building a lot more off camera and I, I like it. Uh, we're getting down to crunch time here. Um, before we know it, uh, Minecraft Marketplace is going to be out. I got all sorts of comments on my videos of people asking me when the Desolation download is coming. Where is the Desolation download? And the answer is I can't. <laughs> Where I'm, I mean, if I could, I might, but I can't. There's no way for me to do it. I'm building on Xbox One, my friends. Wait, I gotta make a mini bar, so let's make that the mini bar. I'm building on Xbox One, so there's no way to share the map yet. But when the Xbox uh, Minecraft Marketplace drops, drops, then things are going to change around here. So I want to get ready for that. I want to make sure that this map is is looking. No, that doesn't work. That this map is just, uh, you know, bumping on all cylinders when that comes out and ready to go. And uh, I don't know when that will be, and I'm pretty sure I'm not going to make the deadline no matter when it is. I got so much to do downtown. Oh my god, downtown, my guys. Have you even seen downtown? There's just so much emptiness over there that uh, I got a lot to do in downtown. A lot to do. So um, I don't know if I'm going to make the deadline. I really don't. I'm going to try, but I don't think it's going to happen. But at any rate, there is a chance that I might release you know, a working progress work in progress map i don't know we'll see um it's possible i'm not ruling it out okay i might do it i just might uh simply because so many people are asking for it and i don't know it seems like people really want it um because i don't know I, I'm, I'm not a very braggadocious person but i have to be honest with myself and with you and Sometimes I think to myself, this is the coolest thing ever built on Minecraft. <laughs> no no exaggeration. Um, uh, you know, if you're not into survival horror, then of course you're not going to you know, resonate with this as much. But if you ask me, whoo, uh, I'm a little biased. Okay, I'm just a little wee bit biased. But I do think in my heart of hearts that this is the coolest thing I've ever seen in Minecraft. And I, I hope some of you will agree. I hope, uh, I guess you probably have some inclination towards that or else you wouldn't be here, I guess, right? You do think it's pretty cool, I would imagine. So let's not do that. That was a good background. All right, I just got through saying that I don't want to spend all day on a video, but here I am just rambling and building. <laughs> this is what I do best. You guys know that. I'm a rambler and I'm a builder and... I ramble as good as I build, and I build as good as I ramble. Alright, so, lots to do in here. I'm not going to hold you. That'll be today's episode. 
Uh, I'm going to finish this off. I'm going to finish those two rooms I showed you. And then it's PvP time. Oh, baby. And if you also, if you have any suggestions or ideas or comments, I'd love to hear what you have to say about this so that we can make this the best warehouse or factory anyone's ever seen. What do you think about the pipes? What do you think about the exterior? What do you think about the interior? Any ideas that I can add for certain things? Oh, yeah, there's two more things. Okay, I, I'm just showing you all the things that are not done. I got two rooms here to work with, to play with. Um, I could do any secrets. If you guys have any ideas for secrets, they can go up here. Um, yeah, what can I put in those two rooms secrets-wise? Oh, man. If you're excited to parkour, let me know. Oh, is this possible? I tried this before. No. <laughs> I didn't even jump. I, I really don't think that jump is possible. I really don't. Oh, I almost made it. Okay, I'm not just gonna... Well, last time, last time, on camera. <laughs> At least I made it to this pipe. Anyway, pipes everywhere. Pipes, pipes everywhere. Not a drop to drink. Okay? So that is going to be the episode for today, my friends. I want to thank you guys for watching. I want to thank you for all the support that you've been giving this channel. I really, really, really do appreciate your likes, your comments, and especially your shares. They really help to spread the word and, you know, grow this community. So I'm happy about that. And I appreciate everything you do in that respect. Um, let me know what you think about Axis Chemicals, what I can do to change it, improve it, uh, you know, whatever. Any ideas that you have for Axis Chemicals. And uh, I'm excited to PvP. So follow me on Twitter to find out when the next PvP is. Because we're going to play in Axis. <sighs> Super exciting, guys. All right, that's the episode for today. Thank you for watching. Thank you for leaving a like if you enjoyed this. Uh, put a comment in the comment section below. And be sure to subscribe if you haven't already. All right, guys. Happy Minecrafting. Peace.